that gross? Isn't that the grossest thing you've ever seen? Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at it. Look at that. There's a party of Guan over there. He's got a little joint in his paw. <laughs> See, there and these lovely ladies said hi. They recognize they watch the channel. Oh my god. There's no place to go on this island, no place to eat. I get to cook in this view with these friends. Happy Easter. It is Thursday, family arrives tomorrow. Got the masters going on, yes. Uh, just got some piddly things to do before everybody gets here. I've complained about this before, now I'm gonna show you. Try to make one of these damn beds in, in, on this boat, and I, it's a workout. Captain Dave stayed down here, so I just washed the sheets. Here we go. Normally you want to provision the states because it's cheaper and more more things to get, but because of you know going on the hard off on you know back and forth, I just didn't have time to do it. So I got the grocery list. It's quite extensive. And we are headed to the grocery store. Okay, back from the grocery store. Mega groceries everywhere. Water, everything. Not the most fun, but you gotta do it. And if you're three miles offshore, you can just, you know, dump it. Uh, you know, it's fish food. But uh, here, uh, my family's coming in. I've been here all week, so we needed to empty it. And you can tell that it's leaving by looking right here. Isn't that gross? Isn't that the grossest thing you've ever seen? We all gotta do it. Somehow, some way. Thank you for having yeah, we made it. Yay, yay, yay. Hey, hey, hey. You guys haven't seen this, have you? Oh, it's beautiful. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, I love the cheers. I know, it right? Is. Well, here we are on the first morning. Hello, gang. Okay, pre training is always essential. That's the first thing we do. Denise, Denise, come on, Denise, guys. Let's go, Denise, come on. Oh, we're gonna dance while we do it. We'll have a crew member of the week at the end. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Tag on your hat, Alan. That's really attractive. Oh, no, it's brand new. <laughs> oh, okay. Hardly noticeable. A little sportier than I uh, thought it was going to be. It's set around one to two footers. I think it's around two to three footers. But it'll probably settle, to that, settle down the, you know, the closer we get. We've got about two more hours to go, and it's an incredible day. Incredible. Fabulous. Fabulous. Perfect. Fabulous. He's Perfect. learned my favorite word. Perfect. Fabulous. Fabulous. It's become part of my vocabulary. <laughs> so we're going to go to Alan's Key. It's about three and a half hours. It's about 35 miles. Play with the iguanas. Then we'll move on to Norman's Key. It's going to be a great day. There was a request for disco music. There she is. Spell happy. This right here. 
Okay, we are about a little more than halfway there. We're gonna get there about two o'clock, a little bit later than I wanted, but uh, that's okay. It's just fabulous. The baby is purring like a top. Quite happy, I might say. Good job, gang. Well, did we enjoy our trip yeah, over? Amazing. The watercolor is the water unbelievable. Unbelievable, yeah. it is. It's crazy. Little prehistoric creatures laying around. Hello, fellas. Oh, the little guy. Little guy. Hi, little guy. Oh, hi. Come here, little guy. Come here. So the iguanas generally stay up in the shade, and then when you pull your dinghy up, they come running at you. Then when they figure out you don't have food, they go back. Just gotta get past the girls and you'll be good. <laughs> when you go in, you just gotta go in. That's it. We're analyzing the iguanas, thinking that there's going to be bullies, and then yeah. iguanas that are too Social. sensitive, Social. and then there's the iguana leader who's very dominant and domineering. So in other words, there is a dope dealing iguana over there. Apparently, apparently, maybe, maybe, maybe a tourist brought it in. They're everywhere. <laughs> Obviously, the iguanas are a great draw, but it's also a great place just to hang out like we're doing right now. Hey, Rob, what did you say? I said it would be cool to see them mating. It would be cool to see them mating. Do you not know how it happens? You have three kids. I know how that part happened. I don't know how they make it happen. And honestly, when I first saw them, I thought their little chin thing looked like a little ball sack. <laughs> my wife say ball sack? Ball sack. Yeah. Yeah. That's if they come at you, kick them in the chin. That'll just that'll drop very exciting. You know that I'm a Dallas Cowboys fan, right? Well, there's Jerry's boat. Right there. Hello, Jerry. Jerry, draft some good players, please. Norman's Key, Norman's Key. Come in. This is the wandering hillbilly. So we want to get our lines off the, the rails and on the floor, ready to throw, and one person at each at each line. Roger that. I didn't know you had a camera. I may have, I have to do a, a sip swap. He didn't know it was a catamaran. Oops. And here we are at lovely Norman's Key. And we're headed to dinner, aren't we, Danny? Right this way. We're headed to dinner. Oh, this is lovely. Hello. Beautiful, beautiful place. Lucky to be on this like little adventure with him. He knows everything. Yeah, so we're sitting at dinner, and these lovely ladies said hi. They recognize. They watch the channel. Oh my god! Hi, hi. <laughs> and he'll be in the next video. Oh, and we are following his recommended itinerary. 
Oh, you are. Oh, yes, okay. we are. Perfect. To a T. Perfect. Really, my friend Rob here loves it when people recognize me, but I have to say, it's really cool having this channel and seeing them. But more importantly, they're following my route. That's yes. what I love. Good morning, gang. It is Easter. Happy Easter to all of you. We're here at Norman's Key, and through the magic of Starlink, we're all going to church right now. Right here. That's our home church in California. And Rob is watching it in his sunglasses because he's from California. Amen, brother. Yeah. And we got breakfast going. Oh. The peeps say happy Easter. Oh my gosh, we got peeps. That's amazing. We are Easter ready. It's fun. A couple of the boats have uh, Easter baskets for their kids next to us, which is cool. So today we're going to go down to Shroud Key. That's fun. And then we're going to grab a uh, mooring ball at Wardrick Wells, hopefully, if there's any available. Well, 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 we're off. Everybody's doing their job. Rob, put it in the hole. Put it in the hole. Woo! Yay! Easter. Woo woo! And the captain. Woo! Incredible crew. Thank you, honey. Another gorgeously beautiful day on the water. Mm. Happy Easter. What do I call the Lazy River, Alex? So I call it the Lazy River, but it's basically a little channel that goes from the Bahamas Banks over to the Atlantic Ocean. It's two to three feet deep. Everybody's got their feet in the water. It feels good. And we're headed over to the beach over there. And we're having a good time, are we not? Coming to the exit of the little river. We'll beach the dinghy and have a wonderful time. We have friends. Hi. Hello, friends. <laughs> friends of the hillbilly. Oh, <laughs> right here. You meet them everywhere. <laughs> I'm Alan. Nice to meet you. Nice and large people are really, really nice when they come up and talk. They want to talk and say hi, take a picture, but they don't want to, you know, hang out. They want to leave us to our privacy, which is nice. It does not suck. The wonderful part about this is that you can go out about a half mile and it's not deep. So you can see everybody out here. There's Dano. Are you in your office? Yes. Me and Dan and Jen. I can't awesome. be more relaxed. I mean, I have to try. I can't. Okay, so the Lazy River is this way and it goes that way out to the ocean, which creates this incredible current, which is why this area is called the Rapids. Swimming out to it. Oh yeah, here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, the water's so warm and beautiful. I'm moving now. Probably can't tell, but I'm really moving. Hold on, about an hour and a half south. We are at Wardrick Wells. I'm about to call in and we're gonna, he's gonna give us a mooring ball number and our gang is gonna do the mooring ball, aren't we? We're gonna try. We, we practiced this morning. We'll see what happens. Look at that crew down there ready to go. As you can see, you kind of pass people very narrowly cause it's very shallow, very shallow. Gonna come up with me? Yep. All right, Dan, go. People I had nothing but confidence. Yes. Nothing but confidence. Way to go. That was great. <sighs> Nobody we said did it. it. Good that. job, gang. Good work. Good job. Almost hit the boat behind me, but we yeah, did okay. You, yeah, you were very, <laughs> we were, very we were close. Awesome. Good job. They did a great job. I got a little close to that guy. Current was really coming in, but uh, we got there. All good. 
there's no place to go on this island, no place to eat. You have to be self-sufficient. That's what we're doing. We're cooking in, playing some music, having some drinks, and enjoying France. We got swimmers. Oh, you look like a lovely couple in love in the water. <laughs> Holding on to a rope. <laughs> no wind here at all, zero. Beautiful, it's really hot actually. Hey, Mrs. Carter made a charcuterie deluxe. We got some rosé happening. Mrs. Carter has a, oh, well, you're sweeping right now, I'll put it down. Okay, so here's boat life. Jen dropped a noodle and it floated down to two boats and they're bringing it back. That's like the Easter noodle you're bringing to us. Hey! You guys gotta follow his YouTube channel. All right. You'll be on it now. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you Apparently we have a sunset he's shark. Right yep. Oh, there he is. Hi. Oh, Hi, shark. How can you miss him? Look how big he is. Seriously, I get to cook food in this view with these friends. I got a quick moment here. Everyone is either taking a shower or they're upstairs enjoying the sunset. Uh, grateful cannot begin to describe the feeling I have right now on this Easter evening.